Hey guys, we're going to take a quick look at a Desert King uh, fig tree. And uh, this guy is about four to five years old and uh, has been growing uh, well here for me and giving me figs for at least two years now. So let's take a quick look at it. All right, so if we kind of poke up in here, you'll start to see some figs getting pretty close. You guys getting nice and droopy. I liked like it when they kind of get a bit of uh, wetness in the eye there and that means that they're nice and sugary sweet at that point uh, but this these guys are getting close and my trick is just beating the birds to them because the birds will start to peck at them uh, they don't consume much of them but they will kind of mess with them so anyway um, let's see if I can zoom in there but you can see uh, pretty decent quantity on this little tree uh, this tree is yeah, I'll zoom back out here oh I would say this guy is probably eight feet tall yeah no maybe ten feet tall and six to seven feet wide so it's definitely grown more vertical than it has oh, pardon the dead kiwi there there's a kiwi vine that didn't get watered as much as it should have <clears throat> but you can kind of see here the fruit ripening up and you know on a little tree probably a good yeah maybe 30 fruit on here so not too bad and uh, of course this is the desert king so these are mostly brebas you can see some main crops up there trying to do something but because this is not we don't have the fig wasp here uh, those guys should not finish up so being that this is a, um, <coughs> a san pedro fig so san pedro figs require the fig wasp to ripen their main crop but the uh, braba crop does not need that so that's what that guy looks like so anyway thank you very much for watching goodbye